Welcome to Cisco. My name is Jane. How can I help you? I'm trying to open a case on the web and I'm getting some silly error message. Okay, what is the error message that you're getting? I don't know. It's an orange box and it's got something about my profile not being associated or something. I don't remember. Ah, so the orange box strikes again. I think your contract isn't on your profile. What contract? Let's back up a bit. Can you give me your cisco.com user ID and the serial number of the product you want to open a case on? My user ID is Billy Goat and the serial number is Mickey Mouse. I've just checked the serial number and it's covered under a service contract. It's currently not on your profile, which is why you've been struck by the orange box. This all sounds like mumbo jumbo to me. Why do I need a contract on my profile? Think of it like your contract is your bank account. So when you go to the bank, you will need proof of ID, which is your cisco.com user ID. We check your user ID to make sure you are allowed to operate the account, which is your contract. So associating the contract to your profile gives you the right to use it. So, so, what, what do I do now? I can help you. I've just associated the contract to your profile. You can now go back on the web and finish creating your case. Right. How do I do this myself without having to call you guys every time? No worries, mate. I can walk you through this. Hi there, and today I'm going to show you how to add a contract or associate a contract to your profile. So first of all, log into cisco.com, and that's www.cisco.com, and that'll take you to our home page right here. Now in the top right hand corner of this page, go ahead and click on account. Now in the next step, you'll see the word profile manager on the left hand side of this page. I want you to click on go now right at the bottom there. And at this point, you'll be asked to log in with your user ID and your password. And as you already know, my user ID is Billy underscore goat. And my password is, well, it's confidential. So put the password in and log in. And that'll take you into your account. There you go. Now across the top of the profile manager, you'll see five options. Contact, Organization, Additional Access, Preferences, and Password Management. Now to add a contract to your profile, you want to click on Additional Access. All right, I'm going to scroll this down so you can see better. Now notice that under Obtain Additional Access, you have a few options once again. Now to add a contract to your profile, click on the second link here that says Add Service Contract Numbers to Profile for Support Access. Now please read through this important information and to add the contract into your profile, simply punch the contract number into this field right here and click on Submit right at the bottom and you've just kick-started the contract association process. Good work.